Now, as of information being put out here, we have a new concern of info that was put out into the community before anyone elsewhere heard about it. This new concern is the flyer. The very first of the flyers were thought to have said Kiera went missing at 82nd and Coles at residence, and later on another flyer stating 81st and Vernon. We also found a flyer that stated 83rd and King Drive as a location last seen. Well, after a little research, we decided to follow the money where the higher the dollar amount, the address would change. But this was not the case. On one of the first flyers we could find, the amount of the reward was a little over $3,000. On it states the address 81st and Vernon as the last time Kara was seen. Afterwards, a $25,000 reward was presented by the U.S. Postal Service where Kiera worked. But this is not to say the flyer with the 82nd and Coles address as the place of residence wasn't the first one. But the fact that it has no dollar amount and along with the 83rd and King Drive address also with no dollar amount just simply puts it as all possible places known to be Kiera Cole's last location to have been seen. The only thing that stands out about 82nd and Cole's address is that it was stated to be the place of residence, yet we have footage of a search party on 81st and Vernon where her car is indeed seen and people coming in and out of her apartment. Now we're going to show you that, but first, let me show you another footage with a search party also on 81st and Vernon but passing out the flyer with 82nd and Coles on it. Tuning in and it looks like people are right now responding. I am out here on 81st and Vernon and we are now getting uh, or, uh, getting acclimated and people are right now responding. I am out here on 81st and Vernon and we are now getting uh, or, uh, getting acclimated and pointing efforts out here. And what I'm very proud of is that on this side right here, you have for the uh, father of Kira Coles, and then I just had the pleasure of meeting mom right here on the other side. So this is the mother and the father of Kiera Coles, and this is the building where she resided in. And now here you have actually a growing number of community people that's coming to help search. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? A growing number of... Uh, Members from the community, people are getting, they're getting here, showing up, getting ready to help. So what we're doing right now in the first half, from what I'm seeing, is that we're passing out the flyers, still making sure that the community is aware. For, you know, pray for all of them. Pray for mom, pray for dad, pray for Kiera. Uh, but I definitely do, could, I could tell the effects of this is starting to take, take its toll on, on pops. Some of the people from my Chicago chapter of, of Justice is here. But we do got the, fa the father and the mother. That's dad over there. That's dad. That's mom. Out here together bringing awareness to the fact that Kira Coles is still missing. Notice Jedediah says, clearly, that's her apartment. Which is awesome. Okay, let me see if I can, well, you can see the flyer. Here's the flyer with 82nd and Coles as residents, but they're presently at her actual residence, 81st and is, Vernon. Wait a Is that better, y'all? Um, I got it right up under the lesson. Oh, hold on. Now here's the footage where a young lady recorded on 81st and Vernon at a search party that shows Kiara Coles' car and people coming in and out of Kiara Coles' apartment building. 
This was October the 8th, about six days after Kiara went missing. Take a look. Taken down from Facebook for whatever reason. But come in. Let me know if you can hear me okay as I get to this video. Come in, come in, come in. I wanted to do it in Missing Please Come Home first. I wanted to share it here first. So as you guys are coming in, hey, Miss Freeman, I see you. Thank you for tuning in. As you guys are coming in, just wanted to make sure that you can hear me okay. I'm going to attempt to try and play this video. Let me turn it around. Okay, so we're out here now. We're on 81st. Where we at? 81st and Vernon? We're on 81st and Vernon. For one, we can use a lot more footwork. We're out here with the family. Um, Channel 2 News is at least out here, so we want to thank Channel 2 News for coming. But Fox, that's Fox, the 32, okay, 32. But, but we need every news station out here. I'm here, I'm right here with the mother right now. Let me just give her a chance. You guys, come on in. Come in, tag, share, and invite. Tag, share, and invite. Um, we got a lot of footwork, and we're getting ready to put this footwork to action. This is the mom. Mom, you haven't seen your baby in a week. It's not normal. This was um, October the 8th. Is it anything that you could say right now if anybody's holding her against her will or if somebody got information and you want them to share it? Yeah, I mean, you know, the smallest thing, any little thing, <clears throat> anything you may have saw, heard, you think, you know, just, you know, inbox me or one of my daughters or anybody in my family, anybody that you see sharing this, you can inbox them and let them know what's going on. I just wish my baby would come on and say. Okay. And you know what? And we and we I'm gonna go down here. We see her car is parked somewhere that is not normally parked. Um so this is where the car home is our group. Was you parked guys could also call our tip up the line. street. So I'm gonna show you guys where we were at up the street. Down the street where the car is located. Eight 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 seven eight eight. I'm gonna post the number. This is from October the eighth. Do we got any best Let me know if you guys can hear me okay. Anybody I can speak to that may have seen her last? Any, got it, um, best friends, anybody? Uh, best friend, uh, best friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Best friend, come here for a second. So when I came yeah, out, I was boy, told by people. He's not out here, okay. So when I when I came, I was told that the mother, the, the hey, hey, uh, sister, the boyfriend, and everybody was out. So that's why I was asking those questions. Um, how long have you guys been best friends since freshman year? You have, is it normal for you not? So I look like a. Right, this is uh, Vera Giles Norris, and I just wanted to share some information. Uh, I'm sorry. What did I just do? Wait a minute, you guys. I apologize. Okay. So okay. So let me ask you something. I know her car is parked like in an odd place. Can you can? It's not usually parked. They standing by it now. Okay, so we're going to go down here. You guys, come in, tag, share, and invite. Again, this is not normal. Um, we got a lot of people out here. We got a lot of people, and we're going to go um, on busy streets. Um, I know my partner, Martin G. Johnson, is out here somewhere. I don't know where he's at. There's quite a few people out here. We want to thank everybody that's come out. And just, hey, hey, baby. We want to thank everybody that's come out, but guess what? We need more footwork because, again, this her car is parked somewhere she's not normally at. We got people looking inside the car right now. Um, I'm going to be fast forward. This is two hours it. long. We don't know if she parked it. We don't know if somebody else parked it. We don't know anything. This is her car right here. So here's her car. Nobody's been able to get in the car or anything, right? No, she's just having a lot of tools prenatal pills right here on the seat. You see her prenatal pills on the screen? They're right here. They're right here. They didn't, so she don't even have... Here they go, right here. You see them? I do. 
Can we can, can, can we call the police? I ain't see that. That's, hey, Martin G, that's got my partner. Can we call the police and see if we can get them to get a slim jam? Uh, now, okay, now I see she's a. We don't know if she. We need to get her report. You guys know that she drove for Lyft. Does anybody know if she had a chance? If she was so, driving? that was Martin G. Johnson getting someone um offered to so give she him she was uh, about to do some permission to use their camera. Pulled Uber. Okay, bring me up to date. Let's pull it Uber. We do, and I don't, and I again, you guys, I'm just sharing this because now there's a flyer here with Kiara's name at the top and the word missing at the bottom with possibly the picture of her in a U.S. postal uniform. Um, this was the first reports for driving. This was on October the 8th. Okay, so we see it's a dent. Does she have an accident? Do you guys know if she had an accident? Because I see her car. That's an old dent. Okay, so her doors is locked. I'm going to be fast forwarding you guys. I just wanted to point this information out. Um, again, I just and wanted to. And even and even the way that she somebody closed her. So her prenatal pills are in the car. And as you can see, can we get the? Can somebody call the police off? Even when her, as, as her doors was closed, door the uh, side view mirrors were pushed in. And I know as a driver, you push those in because you don't want anybody to knock your, you know, uh, people park too close so they may be going down the street. So I, I want you guys to note that as well. And, and do she share her locations with any family members, or you know? Because it was connected. Okay, so they turned off the. The only hope we have is Okay, and 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 her. Let me go a little bit further. Let me go further, y'all. Let's see here. This is a two-hour-long video, so I'm not sharing everything right here. Right. They, they have open apartment. Yes, they have. They opened the apartment. Somebody went in there already. Hold on, you guys. I'm going to get back. They, they have open apartment. Yes, they have. They opened the apartment. Somebody went in there already. Yes, they have. They opened the apartment. Somebody went in there already. Now, let's go to 83rd and King Drive, because this is where I think that ATM is located where Kiara Coles and Joshua Simmons were seen pulling out money at the ATM right before Kiara went missing.
We've also taken a look at the 82nd and Coles area where it's possibly some footage out there of her either passing by in her car or Kiera could know someone in this area where she last visit. Don't really know why this area was presented on one of the most popular flyers out to date. So we can't help with any clues here. And as you can see, the distances between this area and the area of 81st and Vernon is greatly a long distance. I just don't see how these two areas were mistaken with each other as residents. Did the parents not know exactly where she lived before the actual search? Or was it just a simple typo that would be time consuming in order to change it? Regardless of the matter, where is Josh Simmons? And where is Kiara Coles? And her child who will be around three years old to date. <laughs>